the Jags have fired head coach Urban Meyer. And I'm not going to say that we didn't see this coming, but uh, but at this point in the season, it seemed a little weird. It's kind of strange, Chris, that of all the different PR hits that Urban Meyer has taken, the one that finally got him out the door with Shad Khan, I believe that's, that's the Jaguars owner, the one that got him out of there is the idea that he kicked or may have kicked, allegedly kicked, a kicker in the preseason. Josh Lambeau came out and was like, yeah, he's a he's a piece of trash, blah, 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 blah. There's been a lot of things go wrong in Urban Meyer's first year in the NFL, and this was like the the penultimate deal, right? So give me give me your thoughts on Urban being out in Jacksonville. Well, I, I would like to know the details of it. I have kind of been balls deep in the work today. I, I have paid attention to zero sports stuff today at all. So I don't know. Did they fire him for calls? Are they going to pay him the sixty million? I think that they are. They're going to try and find a way to fire him with calls. Right now, he is. Well, he's if, fired. He, if, he, if they can show that he kicked the kicker, then then you got a call because then you he physically you can say he physically assaulted somebody in a workplace, and you know. So yeah. that's that. Uh, I, I will tell you this: I'm not a. I, I don't like Urban Meyer. I we all first off let's. Let's lay this out here quickly. Everybody in the whole world but John Khan knew this was going to be a huge embarrassing failure. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, so, we talked about that so before. Nobody should be surprised that this is a disaster because it's, it's like the most predictable disaster you could imagine. There are people that went to see the movie Final Destination 2 and didn't see the disaster coming as much as we saw this disaster coming. Okay? It's true. <laughs> All right. So that that being said, he is a piece of crap, and he's done a lot of kind of shady, awful things. Whatever. the The least of which is is uh, obviously under consensual situations, letting some girl grind up on his wing. All right. They're both <laughs> old enough, and and you know that that's like the least awful thing he did. But he's a very unlikable guy. This is what I don't like. Okay. I don't like Lambo coming out acting like he's some type of victim and or hero today. Like, if this happened in preseason, why didn't this story come? Why didn't you come tell somebody immediately? Oh, it's it's why like he was waiting, waiting to pile on. It's easy, easy to pile on. Okay, you're waiting until it's easy to stand out and to call somebody out for their crap. Yeah. Right? Yeah, I agree. I, I, it's just ridiculous that this is what it finally took. But if this is the the thing that tipped the scales to where a we can actually fire him without paying him all of that money, uh, then okay, I could totally understand it. It's just a weird thing because, like, how how do you prove that? Like, unless you've got video of him actually kicking Josh, that's a that's a he said she said. But I don't kind of think thing. I don't think you have. But I, in in a court case like this, you don't have to prove it, Gary. It's not beyond reasonable doubt. This is more probable than not. I have not seen anybody that backed up Lambo yet. So that's that's what I'm but curious doesn't matter. about. Has anybody backed up Urban not doing it? And so now you put it before a jury of their peers in, in, in a civil court, not a criminal court, a civil court, and you go before a judge and you try to see what do you think happened and whose story is more believable and all you need is forty nine and a half percent to go your way. Yeah, or okay. 50, 50 and a half percent to go your way. That's it. Yeah, it's That's it's it. not it's not like a criminal court case. It's a it's no, civil. This is not so. beyond is not beyond reasonable doubt. This is more probable than not. That's all you need. And if Urban did it, or if Urban doesn't think he could win that case, he wouldn't even be able to fight it because it could cost him more to fight. It. Yeah, no, that's uh that's a valid point. We'll uh, we'll see what happens. So this is a, a, a strange situation, but not one that we did not see coming. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.